And welcome back to Reliance Stadium. And if you were relying on a on a game that defies description, you had it tonight. It was Reliance Stadium. It's NRG Stadium. We're going to change the name again. You know what? Maybe it's the Astrodome. I mean, all three. <laughs> we, we're doing this show backwards. So I went back in time a little bit. By the way, two overtime games in the history of championship play. Won the greatest game ever played. Alan Amici. Unitas Amici, 1958 championship game. Colts win at Yankee Stadium Giants. The last one, only one other, 1962 AFL championship. Dallas Texans beat Houston Oilers in Houston. So who knew with all the history, Atlanta's first, New England's fifth, and everything that went with it, that we would see this. Houston, we have a classic. So here we go. All right, so in case you forgot, they came charging out, and the Patriots came walking out. The MVP of the league only learned it last night, Matt Ryan, Tom Br and the president, and Barbara Bush flipped the coin. How classic was that president? George H.W. Bush. That was that I mean that was great. And then Courtney Upshaw very early let Tom Brady know Atlanta. We have a defense too. Nobody has talked about it. And Grady Jarrett, he was just all over the place. Man to man, Boomer. Didn't all see him coming. Night long, and then they could not find anyone open early. The speed of the Atlanta de uh, defense was just too much early. And so rough start. Patriots first play second quarter. Brady's going to loft one to Julian Edelman, and that's a 27-yard play. And just like, by the way, the Super Bowl of with the Patriots winner against Carolina, no points scored in the first quarter. LeGarrette Blunt gets the handoff, and he is not supposed to lose the football, but Deion Jones strips him. That Atlanta defense looked kind of like the Seattle defense, you right? Three points at halftime. Why? You get in the red zone, you fumble, take a bad penalty, until interception. That's very unpatriot like So... Robert Alford is there for the recovery. Then, here comes Atlanta. Off the turnover, they smell it. Julio Jones, he's just a monster. Randy, we talked about it. 19 yards. They should have threw more balls. Tony Boom on him. Four catches for tonight, man. They needed him. And then, here goes Ryan. And here he is again. Rips the ball away from Logan Ryan. Look at this. I mean, it's just 23 yard gain. Devontae Freeman, they were having trouble stopping the run. It's a 15 yard gain. Then it's Freeman again from the 14. And makes the move to the five. We're going to have James. You're going to enjoy the whole highlight here. James <laughs> Freeman into the end zone. Somebody scored a touchdown at the end, and we'll get it to you. We. <laughs> We don't, we, we don't want to give away the yeah, no, We've waited 45 minutes for these highlights. We can't quit now. <laughs> <laughs> it's 7 nothing for Dan Quinn and the Falcons. Dan. On third and seven. And, James, you thought you might have picked up a first down here, but not quite. <laughs> They're all over you, right? Yeah, man to man. <laughs> Falcons Speed. defense speedy, weren't they? They were fast. Falcons looking to extend the lead. Ryan Taylor Gabriel. I love that he wears Roman Gabriel's number 18. And you know what? The Patriots put a lot of different looks in Matt Ryan's face, and they just ran and passed right through it early. Ryan, the whole kitchen sink. Rolling left. Julio Jones. How does he constantly get his feet in like that, Randy? Great focus and great concentration. That's why he is the alpha male. <laughs> so now third and nine from the 19. To the tight end, it's Austin Hooper. A perfect throw. Ryan, Matt Ryan, Falcons, Dan Quinn pumped. It's 14 0 Hotlanta. No team has ever come back from a 14 point deficit in the Super Bowl. James White. I, I keep hearing his name. I'm going to meet him. <laughs> Mama, there goes that man. There's a flag. Here comes some flags. So, first down, even though it was short of a first down. Now, Brady. Incomplete. Another flag holding on Falcons. So now the drive continues. Oddly enough, it was the flags, not the Patriots' rhythm that was doing it. Incomplete up the middle. Another flag. Game we took fired. a page from Bill Belichick's book. We are going to be physical. You might call three or four holds, but we're going to be physical all day long and take advantage because you're not going to get a thousand different penalties called against you. Yeah, but guess what? It came around the other way. Offered. Cut. Go. All the way. It's my goodness.
It's a pick six. It's 21-0. Home Depot giving stuff away. I mean, it's, look at this play here. That was a great play by that young kid offer, man. They needed more plays in the second half, man. That was a great play called by Coach Quinn, man. And Tom wondering how we had to come back from 21 points down. Well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look for James White. You know, because that name keeps coming up. I don't know what it is about this. <laughs> Tackled inside the Falcons 30, 28-yard game. Brady. James White across the middle. Did you feel it at this time a little bit, James? I knew I had to, I had to win one-on-one -on -one matchups. Uh, be a viable option for Tom. I just want to be open to every player as a pass play. Just want to be open every single time. 18 seconds to go. A little screen pass inside the five. There's a flag. Martellus Bennett, though, holding. And you guys must have been wondering, really? <laughs> really? We were, man. Got some tough breaks, uh, but guys kept fighting. Uh, just find a way to win the game. And so, look, trying to get a touchdown, but a screen. That's certainly not the design. That was a dump off. And so it only resulted in a field goal, 21 to 3 at the half. It's over. It's all over. 21 to 3. There's something coming here, James. You might want to stick around. <laughs> I'll stick around for it. <laughs> First drive of the third quarter. And then you wondered, okay, Chris Hogan can't quite hold on. A couple Falcons in the area. Two plays later, first drive, third quarter. Julian Edelman, who would be a circus catcher later, couldn't make the catch. This was odd. You know what? Good. You heard Coach Belichick talking about the way his left tackles played. Look at these highlights and look at Cannon and Soldier, man. So three and out. Now here's Matt Ryan, Taylor Gabriel, and they smell it. A touchdown could put the thing away. Second and five from the 37. Ryan Gabriel takes a hard hit but holds on. Malcolm Butler falls to the ground, but a big play, Ryan. You know what? They tried to match up Malcolm Butler a few times, and he was short. He came up short throughout the game until late when it really mattered. And then Ryan to Gabriel, but there's the flag, and Butler on third down. That looked like a good call, fellas. <laughs> yes. yes. That was a great call, man. Championship football. They got to call that, boom. All right. And so Ryan on the pass interference goes to Tevin Coleman, and it's 28-3. to three. And the South's going to rise up. It's 28-3, to three, and it's certainly it's over. The Patriots in four-down territory already. Fourth and three from the 46. Brady to Amendola, 17 yards. The beginning of everything that you need to do to come back and win. That was the first of many that are going to come in the next 16 to 20 this minutes. This was the biggest play of the game for a while for the Patriots. Did you know we could run that fast? I game? did. He's actually pretty fast sometimes. <laughs> JJ, who is this James White that's scoring a touchdown on that play? You knew you couldn't fool around, right? <laughs> nope, they had to turn around, get the ball in. Uh, 28 9, and then really, like, doink. So, all that, I know it's only one point. It's like, really? It's 28 9. That was two minutes left in the third quarter, early fourth quarter. Now, Tom Brady. To Malcolm Mitchell, the youngster. <laughs> Look at he, we have the youngster right here. Money Malcolm, match. welcome to the. You guys might want to watch this. You might not believe what happened. Nice grab here. Thank you. And then Martellus better 25 yards. Here come the Patriots, but it's still 28-9. But you got to remember the calculus that they're making right now on what they need to get this done, and they didn't expect that and have to settle for three. They were thinking about three scores, but not they wanted a touchdown right here. Grady Jarrett didn't do it once. He was a monster, wasn't he? He had a heck of a game. Unfortunately, they was on the losing ends, but he had a dominant game. And so it's just a field goal, but now 16 points. 28 to 12, 16 point deficit. And here's the play. Dante Hightower on third and one. It's a fumble, and the Patriots have the football. When you look back at this game, this is where it turned. This is an inexcusable deep drop, third and one. You got the blitz. Everyone knew it. I saw it coming from five seconds before the snap. You cannot hold the football in that situation and allow that. And then, you know what? Dwight Freeney has played against Tom Brady 16 times. Do you think they, do you think they know each other? So if it's a five-yard loss, but so what? <laughs> and then... <laughs> who is this Malcolm Mitch? Who, uh, who is this guy? He, he's a youngster, isn't he? Yeah. Tom, <laughs> Tom said to get open. Brady to Danny Amendola. It's 28-18. 
tell us about this play, James. Two point conversion. I uh, worked on it in practice for a couple of weeks. Uh, just catch the ball from the center. Just find a way to get in the end zone. Two point conversion makes it 28 20. If you're scoring at home, it's a one score game. So now here's the kickoff. And this is what the Patriots do the, the kick to like the two, right? So you got to field it. And then. You got them deep in their territory. That's just brilliant. That's a great call by the special team coach. A lot of y'all kickers for next season, man. Try to pin mm -hmm. your team inside the 25. That was a great call. Yeah, but here's a great call. Devontae Freeman, who looked like he was too fast for the Patriots defense all night. 39-yard pickup. Two plays later, second and nine. This is what Coach Belichick talked about. Julio Jones is out of this world. Incredible throw and an Absolutely. even more incredible catch. Look at the body control. Look at he said the second. You think is he gonna get down? Oh, he gets down like he's like Coach said a, a yard inside the, the line. Nothing you can do. Nothing. <laughs> okay, so game over, right? The game's over. Game's over. You're in field goal because, range. Go up by twelve. They're gonna, right, they're gonna go up right. They're gonna go up by eleven. 11. And second and 11 from the 23. Deep Trey drop. Flowers. Deep drop. Oh, that ball has got to come back. There's the it, sack. I, I can't tell you how inexcusable that is. That cannot happen. The ball has got to come out. The play calling cannot put it to a deep drop. Those are things that lose Super Bowls. And third and 23, Ryan to Muhammad Sanu. So maybe enough for a long field goal, but Jake Matthews called for holding. So twice out of field goal and, and by the way it was a hole so now third and 33 what play you got for this good luck they go to taylor gabriel they just want a field goal and they cannot get it and now they force a punt but remember it's 28 20 it's about three and a half oh this part of the movie we've seen before just Tom, so you know chris hogan for 16 yards first down then, Malcolm Mitchell, there you were. Yes, they were giving you space, weren't they? Too much. <laughs> 11 yards. Brady over the middle ball oh, tip. Man. And you guys are watching this. All of us. This is amazing. Julian Edelman, they reviewed it on the challenge. What? Uh, wow. That's, that's you incredible. You see that. <laughs> I saw it. I saw it. I was running right to it. <laughs> That's the get back from the helmet catch from the Giants. That's what. Yes, yeah. it's only fair. It's only fair. I was a kid watching that game. And so, uh, well, so now Brady to Danny Amendola. Over two minutes to go. 20 yards across the middle. Then, James, what are you seeing here? Take uh, it and go as far as you can, right? Yep. Uh, just find it in the playing zone. That's his own call. Catch the ball, get up the field, get as many yards as possible. And then here it is. Right. Ooh, near the goal line. <laughs> Under a minute. Tick, tick. There you go. What are you smelling like when you get in there? Oh, man, I'm just real excited, <laughs> man. Didn't really know what to do. <laughs> you, know, you knew before the game you were going to catch 14 for 110, right? Two points. No, <laughs> no clue. He barely makes it. Look, good look, guys. Take a look. Uh, 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 yeah, yeah. He's in. He's in. And now we have 28 all. And we go to overtime, and the Falcons had a shot with the coin toss. Yeah, we'll take the ball, right? It's now, over, boom. <laughs> All right, you guys, here's the swing to James White. James, just just pick up yards, right? <laughs> just pick up yards. <laughs> Danny Amendola. Great catch. Oh, how about the throw and catch there, fellas? Then Brady to Chris Hogan. The loft, ooh, just in front of the defense. And then it's got to be Edelman, right? Got to be a slot and here they go now james you take us through this Ooh, uh, little... swing screen uh we ran earlier in the game i got tackled on my shoelaces that time got as many yards as i could on that <laughs> and this was a tight call of pass interference tight yeah, he never got his head back so you know you feel like well doesn't matter what's on the line you don't get your head back it's part of the rule you're gonna get called for it here's your touchdown james uh, toss play. I mean, just had to run through one guy. Just want to do whatever it took to get the ball in the end zone. It was pretty quick celebration. Did you know they were reviewing this? No, I had no idea. I, I knew for sure I got in, so I was celebrating. <laughs> so was he. And here it is. Take a look. Yep. Right there. <laughs> yep. And Boomer, you and I were sitting up, and we're right here about three feet away. <laughs> <laughs> 
Let the confetti fall, gentlemen. Congratulations. That's as emotional as we've seen, Coach. Ever. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so we, and of course, the scene that looked that like it never That was awesome. Could, it was never going to happen, right? <laughs> it did happen, Boom. That was awesome. You read his lips. Yep. The Lombardi Trophy to the Cramps, to the Patriots, to the players, and in overtime, the first Super Bowl ever to go to overtime. Down by 25 points. The New England Patriots in overtime.